Hi friend! Today we're talking about what could make the Remarkable Paper Pro even better. Imagine if this device had those extra features that would make everything smoother, faster and even more practical. We're not just dreaming here, these are the things that could genuinely improve our day-to-day -day experience, whether we're using it for work, study or just to stay organized. So if you've ever found yourself thinking, I wish it could just do this, you're not alone. I've put together a wish list of upgrades that would take this device to a whole new level, making it even more flexible and intuitive to use. And the great thing is, Remarkable actually listens to users' feedback. They have a place where you can send in your ideas so these wishes could be within reach. Let's jump in and explore on some of the top features we'd love to see in the Remarkable Paper Pro. Hyperlinks between documents. One feature that could really change the game for the Remarkable is the ability to link between documents. Imagine creating a detailed planner where each month, week or even day links to a separate in-depth page within its own notes, tasks or events. This would allow us to build super organized interactive documents that work exactly the way we need them to. For students or professionals managing loads of information, being able to tap directly between connected pages or notes would save time and help keep everything in one accessible place. No more digging through files to find the right info. It's all connected just to tap away. Dictionary for EPUB books. For anyone reading in a second language or even just looking to understand new vocabulary, a built-in dictionary for EPUBs would be huge. Right now, the Remarkable doesn't allow us to look up words directly on the device, which can really interrupt reading flow, especially if you're trying to build vocabulary or work through a challenging text. Plus, this device is already designed to support focus, so features like a dictionary will only add to that experience without being distracting. And while we're at it, it'd be helpful to see some additional reading details like a progress bar or time left in a chapter. But ultimately, the dictionary would have been the biggest impact on making reading smoother and more intuitive. Calculator. This one's a classic that just makes sense. A calculator right on the Remarkable would be a great addition, especially for students or professionals who frequently work with numbers. Back in the day, we'd have a pen, paper and calculator side by side, and it was perfect for focusing on a task without any distractions. The Remarkable's design philosophy is all about simplicity and keeping focus, so a calculator would feel like a natural fit. It will give us one more tool to work with, especially for quick calculations without needing to reach for another device or app. Split screen. A split screen option would take multitasking on the Remarkable to a whole new level. With this, you could open two documents side by side, making it easy to compare information, copy notes, or look at a reference while working on something else. Think about reading a research paper and jotting down ideas right next to it, or following a checklist as you go through a project plan. The possibilities are endless and it's a feature that would make the device even more versatile without sacrificing the focused experience. Sticky notes. Having sticky notes would be a fantastic way to keep your thoughts, comments or reminders right where you need them. Picture it as a mini layer or text box that you could pop over any document. Whether you're annotating a report, marking up a draft or just needing a quick space to jot down ideas, sticky notes would make the device feel even more like a digital notebook. They could even act as a scratch pad for random thoughts or calculations without disrupting the main document, similar to Windows sticky notes. It's all about flexibility and this would give us just that. Global search. Global search across all nodes could truly be a game changer. Right now, there's no easy way to scan your handwritten notes all at once, but a feature like this would allow users to quickly locate specific notes or keywords, saving tons of time and helping keep track of details. It'd be especially useful for handwritten notes we've converted online, letting us search through everything, even if it wasn't typed. This would be an invaluable tool for students, professionals or anyone who manages multiple notes. Even though it may require online recognition to function fully, it would still make a powerful difference in keeping information accessible and organized on the go. 
Before we jump to the next section, I just want to ask you to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying this video. Appreciate your support. Save notebook page or PDF page as a template. Imagine being able to save any page from a notebook or a PDF as a custom template. This would allow us to set up and create a perfect format that we need and reuse it whenever we want, which could be incredibly useful for things like consistent meeting notes, task lists, or journaling layouts. Instead of recreating layouts every time, you could just save a favorite page and bring it up whenever you need it. It's a small addition that would make a big difference in how flexible the Remarkable can be. Color buckets in the sidebar. Adding color buckets to the sidebar could make switching colors so much smoother. With a couple of quick color selections right next to your pen tools, changing colors would take no time at all, making the whole note-taking process feel more fluid. Whether you're color coding notes, marking important sections, or just adding a bit of visual organization, these quick access color buckets would make it easy to switch things up in just one tap. Automatic sync to Google Drive and Dropbox. Automatic syncing to Google Drive and Dropbox would solve a huge inconvenience with the current setup. Right now, you have to manually transfer files back and forth, which isn't just time consuming, but also creates duplicates instead of overwriting. An auto sync option would keep everything organized and up to date across platforms without extra steps. Imagine adding a new annotation to a document on the Remarkable and it automatically updates the version in your Google Drive or Dropbox. Delete option in the selection tool. A delete option in the selection tool is another small but much needed improvement. Currently, you can only cut content as a workaround to delete it, which isn't exactly ideal. With a simple delete button, removing content would be quick and intuitive. Plus, having the option to change the color of selected text or areas would add another layer of customization, allowing us to organize notes by color more efficiently. Pen option selection. A more efficient pen selection method would make the Remarkable even more user-friendly. Right now, it takes a few clicks to adjust pen color or thickness, which can slow down the flow of note taking. Imagine if we could just adjust color and thickness in a single tap, making it easy to switch on the fly. This would allow us to work faster without breaking focus, whether it's switching to a thicker pen for headings or a different color for emphasis. Refresh button. A refresh button may sound simple, but it would make a big difference for a device with an e-ink screen. Ink displays can sometimes leave faint remnants of past screens, called ghosting, and having a quick way to refresh could keep everything looking clear and sharp. A simple tap to reset the screen would also be useful if we ever encounter minor glitches or need a quick cleanup, helping to keep the whole experience smooth and distraction-free. Move text on the page. Allowing converted text to be freely moved around on the page would add a whole new level of flexibility. Right now, if you want to rearrange notes or text, you're limited by how they're initially written. With the ability to move any text block, we could easily organize notes, adjust layouts, or even create custom templates by moving sections around. This would make the Remarkable feel more like a true digital notebook letting us edit and adjust without hassle. Support for more languages in handwriting recognition. Expanding language support for handwriting recognition would be a fantastic improvement. Right now, the Remarkable doesn't support several widely used languages like Arabic, Chinese, Japanese, Hindi, Urdu, or Farsi. Adding these would make the device much more accessible to users around the world who want to take handwritten notes in their own language. It would open up new possibilities for people who rely on different scripts, truly making the Remarkable a global device. Now, I want to hear from you. Which of these features would make the biggest difference for you? Is it the global search, sticky notes, or maybe the ability to link between documents? Let me know in the comments down below. And if you're hoping to see any of these changes in the Remarkable, you're in luck. Remarkable actually has a feedback page where you can share your ideas. I'll link it in the description. Who knows, if enough of us reach out, they may just listen. Or hey, feel free to send them this video for good measure. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you're new here, go ahead and subscribe for more updates and tips on getting the most out of your tech. 
Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.